We're switching up the cabin content, the cottage content, the cabin. I have been working and working and working and working on heavy intensive lifting labor and I'm tired. Walter, the van, this guy, has been sitting here so sad and lonely. So I'm gonna just take him for a night out. Oh my God. Ready, Walt? Who would just leave you so unattended and unwell, huh? I realize it seems like it's been about three seconds. I promise I've been packing. I just have nothing to show for it. I'm so close. I'm gonna hit the road. Okay, van is all packed up. Now I just need to go get my little mousey. Oh, hi. Got her. <laughs> Come here, baby. Okay, baby. Here you go, little bug. Okay. Are you gonna start, Walter? You're such a good boy. Walter, you make me so happy. Look at us go, buddy. Here we go. Walter, you haven't been on the road in a dang long time. Oh, this bro's out. So I am not at just like some random camping set. I know the owner of this property and they're not here right now and they said I could just park on their land. So I'm just pulled up to the, on the other side of their little creek where there's a clearing and I'm gonna just, oh, I guess I could turn that off. Oh, there are mosquitoes. I do this thing where I buy plants like every single time I, mm -hmm get in the van because every time I get out of the van I put the plants in the house and then I don't ever return them to the van. It's just an excuse to buy more plants really. Despero, I think you go on the counter. Okay. Ooh, it's a dusty dusty mess back here. Ew. The back doors of my van like don't close all the way or they they close but like they don't they don't seal out dust and stuff. Okay. Wow, I'm starving. <laughs> I think I'm gonna make some dinner and also put my plants in their pots. There's just dirt everywhere. Even with my eyes still closed, feel it coming in. Golden. Okay, friends, I don't want to lie to you, so I'm not gonna. <laughs> it absolutely brought my meal kit, one of my meal kit meals. So this is gonna look a lot fancier than I would ever make on my own. You didn't know you were watching a cooking show, did you? What are the instructions? Beans and their liquid. Gold hair, gold rings, gold leaves, gold anything, gold. I'll follow only gold. Theoretically, I'm supposed to be mashing these beans. I've just got my little fork here. I might just have whole bean quesadillas. That might just be what's happening. Whoa, that's hot oil. Fun! Oh my god, I'm actually making food. Mm -hmm. Who would have ever thought I would be doing that? Okay, Staying alive! Eating alive! Walk up the river. Feet step over splinters of the moon. Uh, 
I need to like cut this. Yeah. That sounds right. Yeah. I don't know if it's done or if it's stuck or what. Bon appetito. Never seen a meal like this. Mm. Oh yeah. I would die for Corona right now. Some things need to soak. The trick is to do all the cleanest things first so your water stays relatively clean. Oh, the mosquitoes love it down here though, man. Thought it would be nice to take a walk, but the biting flies are brutal right now. I have to pick up my friend Cassia from the airport. driving for so long um i finally got to the cities and i'm gonna pick up my friend katya from the airport but she's not here yet so i'm going to go meet up with my friend annie if you remember annie she's in she's been in a video we slept in a cave together so that was in a video a while ago annie is a car guy or car gal car gal i guess we're both car gals at this point she's um definitely more so than i am i may or may not have bought a bronco we all have our vices right <laughs> So anyway, I got really fixated on Broncos and I enlisted Annie's help. So she went and found me one and bought it. So now I own a Bronco. It needs some body work, paint job, that kind of thing. But we're going to work on those things. But I haven't seen it in person yet. So I'm stopping by to hang out with her, see the Bronco, drive it around a little bit and have some fun. Yeah, I'm excited to see it. So that's, that's it. For the, yeah, here we go. Oh, that's mine. Okay, I'm getting in the Bronco for the second time because I had to film <laughs> This is Annie, if anyone remembers Annie. These are her. Annie got me balls. <laughs> fuzzy, <laughs> fuzzy toys. I can't believe it's mine. The two things that came with it that I thought were cute. This is for the winter. It has a little jacket. <laughs> for what? Uh, so when the, you turn on the car, it keeps like the heat in. So when you're like, the, it keeps the radiator warm. Wait, so you put it on the front? Yeah. It's, oh my it's, God. It literally <laughs> snaps on like a snap jacket. It, has, it looks like a little down it jacket. It has a puffy. <laughs> or if I'm just Wait, cold. honestly, kind of. It looks like a little uh, army vest. Yeah. Like a bulletproof vest. I should just wear this while driving. Like it like matches the car. <laughs> 
Oh my god, are there automatic windows in here? Yeah. I don't have any vehicle with automatic Shit's windows. It's fancy in here, and they all work. I literally have three. I have three vehicles, and none of them have automatic windows. It's actually crazy because some of the things in here that normally don't work work. Like all of the windows. Does the work. back window? The, work? Yeah, it does. <gasps> what? Okay, all right. Oh, we're gonna try, try turning it. it on. Apparently, it's. it's you kind of have to okay. like turn it over aggressively. Oh. <laughs> oh my god! Fun. Uh oh. Where's the rear window? How do I do that one? That oh, I found it. Oh, it. I don't know if it does work. <laughs> oh, that's a janky button. Oh, I mean, it does work if you push the oh button my gosh. into the car far enough. I'm stoked on this. Sick. It's also going to be, that's, it's like so wide. I am going to be able to like sleep in here so easy. Yeah. I've decided so I things. only buy vehicles based on the ability to sleep in them. Well, I couldn't believe how big it is because like putting it next to the Range Rover, mm -hmm. I was like, oh my gosh, it's like a big Ford truck. I'm going to drive this out to the road and then I have to grab my mouse. <laughs> Can I leave her in your house? She's in a cage. One more time. <laughs> I brought my mouse. <laughs> Can we go get her and put her in your house so she doesn't overheat in the car? <laughs> sure. She's yeah, so let's you, you haven't met her. Let's yet. go get her. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my god. I like cannot get a gauge on how big I am. All right, well, you haven't seen us in a moment because the adventure started when we got in the car to drive around and then we went on. Wait, is this the lever for the... Yep. Yeah. Yeah. We found a free grill on the side of the road. So Annie, Annie, Annie wants to make kebabs tonight. So if we're going to put this oh, grill in here, we need to wear the proper attire. We... <laughs> <laughs> Let's get this grill. <laughs> we look so... <laughs> we both just... <laughs> Crawled out of the trunk with our hats. How you look cute right now? What's going on? All right, let's get this girl. Just to prove we're not stealing it. Pretty works great. It's gonna be a tight fit. How much room do you have on that side? Um, a little bit. Keep it white. Wait, I'm sorry. It's an experience. This car was so clean before. I know, it was really clean. Oh I mean, are we just wearing the hat for the rest of the night? Yeah. It's fashion, darling. Fashion! So we're gonna go take a photo shoot? We're gonna do a photo shoot. Yeah. Look at it! Oh, it's so cute! It is so cute. Oh my god. Ah! Sorry, I'm not trying to like squeal with this. <laughs> I'm not laughing because you're a face! Why does that hurt so bad? Oh, I can't use my arm tonight. Well, you look fat ass bruise, dude. I know, that's gonna be like real gnarly. Yeah. <laughs> Took us all day to find a cute spot. And this says no overnight camping, but I wonder if we could just do it. I think we should just do it. We didn't know what you meant by overnight camping. We're just overnight parking. Let's see how you're doing, Despero. Hi, lovely. Hi, little one. Oh, I love you, yes. Yes, I do. <laughs> Oh my god, we finally made it. <gasps> oh, we got real dusty back here. We did get a little bit of dirt. <laughs> we did get some dirt off of it. Well, it's either from the plants or just from the roads. It's okay. It sweeps off pretty easy. Ooh, it feels so good. It's like the perfect temperature. We blew the paddleboard. I feel like you got no intro at all, but I just, they'll get I to know you. 
This sucks. Head banging. <laughs> Gotta put your whole body into it. Yeah. <laughs> Squats. <laughs> Whoa. That's good enough. Have the keys. Good. <laughs> Yeah, I think we should paddle upstream now and then float downstream. Am I wrong? Oh other side, other side. Listen, I'm definitely helping. Can I just pull you? Yeah. <laughs> Please. <laughs> you pull me upriver and I'll let you on the on the paddleboard downriver. <laughs> Look at that fishy fishy. Whoa! <laughs> The typical van <laughs> <laughs> Down by the river. Wee! Here we go! <laughs> we should collect stuff. <laughs> oh, this is my favorite part about van life. You get back on your road trip and you're gonna find this all the time. The hardest part is definitely like finding purpose, you know, like because mm -hmm. there's only so many times you run into this and you feel fulfilled. You have to find something. That's why I liked YouTubing um, when I was on the van. When I was making coffee, it would be like arranging things and like, you know, like setting up shots. And it was like a creative direction. Yeah, I would definitely have to do that. It'd be nice yeah. if you were working a remote job too. Because, you know, a couple days a week, be like, okay, it's a work day. I'm going to a coffee shop, sit down and work for five hours. Yeah. Like, having something to do that feels like you're part of the world still. Otherwise. I don't think I've ever, like, traveled somewhere without kind of having, like, a reason, I guess. Mm -hmm. Even now when I'm thinking about traveling to North Carolina or whatever, I'm always thinking, like, okay, who do I know in what place so that I have somebody to visit or a reason to go there? I feel like it's important to be aimless though for a while because it makes you figure out how to just be when you are uncomfortable. You're the reason why I'm yeah. out of it <laughs> yeah. in the first place. Yeah. Let's take a like 20 minute nap. It'll be 7.30 then. We napped, we slept, we did nothing. After we watched McCallit, did the did the thing in the in the water, and then we just got wine because we're gonna go to a drive-in movie. We're gonna go see Thor. This is my first time going to a drive-in theater. Yeah, if we can find Jiffy Pop, that'll be really fun though, because uh, I don't I don't know how I don't know. Are you allowed to like cook at a I guess we'll find at a drive-in? <laughs> She hasn't been to a drive-in yet. <laughs> She's excited about her first experience. And this is my first time. <laughs> Don't worry about it. What is this I, for? I like puke your Burger uh, King shirt. Sure. Oh, <laughs> it's like this is like a puke bag or something. Enjoy, cool. guys. Thank you. Wait, which one am I going? Uh, one that one. Yeah. Okay, thanks. Take my van for trips. I'm definitely gonna be doing this. I went to Slenderman. What the fuck? Yeah, alone. I, and then I. Why would you do that? I don't know. Unsure. Very unsure. I don't really get scared by movies. Not even when you're like camping in the woods by yourself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, it's on like a hill too, so it's like super yeah, I know. tall. Raised in the way of the world, Thor was taught to help the 
fighting the blue or what is that? I'm just go, go. Despero at go, 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 the drive-in. Go, go, go. Oh my god, I love her. You are insane. It's me, Thor.